What's up guys, it's the Sports Squad and we're back with another episode of CaliCraft. As you can see, last episode was a huge success. We made a great base, also redstone door back there. I went ahead and cleared off the entire mountain right here of trees, well, almost the entire mountain. I actually talked to a few of the members and this is, they're planning on building a huge castle right here. These are going to be the walls for it. I haven't completely done the walls. There's just going to be a huge castle right there. It's going to be really cool. As you can see, there hasn't been much else that is done to this yet. Other than my tree and then that cave that I showed you guys in the last episode. And then also, me and Jacob made this really cool bridge sort of thing. And I'm also, I'm also thinking about taking out this melon farm because it really serves no purpose. It's really... It's not a great melon farm at all, and I don't know what I'm going to do with it other than terraform this bit down. But right now, before I terraform that, I want to expand this wheat farm. It's too small for all the cows. I'm on my last little bit of steak, and I'm only at four levels of XP, and I'm telling you this maybe provides a stack and a half of wheat each time, and that's not enough to feed cows. So I'm thinking about extending out to like here, and then making it go way down there, like two more drops. It's gonna be huge. After that very long time lapse, we have finally, oh, he's on, we have finally got the wheat farm done after, I think, I think it was an uh, hour, two hours of work, and then, oh, and then a little bit more for the watermelon farm that is, oh, well, non-existent anymore. Oh, I'm getting a little close. So, <clears throat> the wheat farm that we have, harvested it a couple times now. It is so efficient, but I can say it is very hard to, uh, you know, replenish with more seeds. I think it takes six stacks, six and a half stacks, just to put all the wheat back. But then over here, oh my lord, this, it just looks so good. I, I don't know what else to say. Compared to the watermelon farm, like, come on, that looks amazing. That's got to be one of my more one of my better terraform projects, I guess you could say. So, what I'm thinking about doing right now is building an automatic item sorter. I said I was going to build one in my basement, but I thought what do people do? They build everything underground and I want to expand myself. I want to work above ground. I went out of my comfort zone with this tree and it turned out okay. I, I like it. I went out of my comfort zone with pretty much every build I do. Every build on the server I've done is new. I've never built a tree in my entire life in Minecraft like this. Every tree house I do, I just wrap around a staircase up going up or a regular tree. Uh, automatic item, uh, or automatic wheat farm. I've literally made one other in a different SMP. Th that house, I literally, I was experimenting with it for an hour and eventually it turned out great. Like, you gotta expand yourself. You can't just stick with the things you know. 
So what I'm thinking is I make a building for the item sorter. I make a, a huge building. And I'm thinking about here or here. I want it to be close to my base for sure. I'm not sure if I want other people to use it. I might I might make it a clan uh, item sorter, but I kind of want it to be mine though. I'm not sure. Uh, hopefully we can use common courtesy and keep it to me. I just want it to be above ground to look nice. So I'm thinking right there or there's one more spot over here but i'm just not sure because it's not close to my base i was thinking right in this jungle because my thoughts on our clan is the jungle is still overtaking the scene yes we have a lot of stuff i think my tree really takes out a portion of our clan's area but if you really look the jungle is completely overtaking everything i think the only thing that is going to be overtaking our jungle scene is this so last time I checked in with you guys, they were on they only had a little bit of the walls. This is what they have now. They have the base to the castle they're gonna make. I showed you guys what the castle is gonna look like before, and let me tell you, it is gonna look amazing. I am not contributing on that project, so I'm doing personal projects. But I'm contributing some stone to them uh, and some other resources. Um <clears throat> me and Jacob are. And we're gonna leave that to a couple people that know how to build. So right now, I am going to start clearing out uh, a spot for the building. I'm not sure what base design I want to use on that, like what building to go up. I, I don't know yet. It's it's a process. of I, I don't even have an image in my mind yet. So first of all, let's get started on clearing the area. So I finally finished the flat area. It is, I, I think I'll have to make it a little bigger, but for the size it is, it, it is what it is. I'm, I'm not gonna make that big of an item sorter, just the essential items. Um, but I saw there are three Ice Clan members online, all three of them which I can get in Discord call with. I only have Elix head on my wall. I want to be able to collect, like, everyone's. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I don't have flax or cubes. Head. I'm, I'm gonna go get them. Why is, why is paper made out of sugar cane in, this one, in real life when it's made out of wood? Nice. Oh, the last time I played, I expanded the sugar cane farm by a lot. Is there a way to put, like, unbreaking or something on... Yes. Do they really not have- One of the <gasps> Here, how about you put it <laughs> It might be an arthropod, but I don't- Or if you it. get unlucky and get a, 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 a spider jacket. I just got some chainmail legs with, uh, breaking three that are almost broken. Very close. I have myself muted on Discord. There it is. Okay. What enchantment should <gasps> I buy next? He might have oh, seen have me. Another... He might have seen me. Vincent, do you still have that uh, discount? Uh, I gotta go bind it. Buy He's like removing a mountain or something book. over there. Or should I just take an unbreaking? Book? Get on the roof. Vincent, yeah. do you still have that discount? Go, go to like the yeah, corner of the wall. Go to the corner of the wall. Which corner? <laughs> I guess we the one I'm looking at. Oh, whoa. How am I supposed to tell which one you're like? Um, enough. That's per two villagers, so I- And there's like nine villagers, so take like ten stacks. I'm gonna go mining now. Uh, fill up my entire inventory with stacks, got it. One. That Lucas. That's the ice-flavored igloo, yeah. 
That's helpful. So I need a uh, yeah. potion of weed. Why? <sighs> My apples. I traded hard <gasps> for those <gasps> damn apples. <gasps> How did he see me? <laughs> well, it took 59 out. Cool, where the hell are How did he not see me? I'm going. Then you say it was like what? negative 300 or something. No. <laughs> it's 1800 negative 300. Yeah. <laughs> okay, where are you? Uh, do you want me to tell you my coordinates right now? Yes. Which... Oh. <laughs> Assault from the sky. How have they not seen me? What the heck? Go inside. Cole. I don't have a bow. The ones you're looking for are in the else. building in their pits. Okay, that's Vincent. I don't no. have his head. And I'm pretty sure that's also Cole, but I have them. his head. They are insignificant. Come down this hallway. Trade. Do not feel like getting my head back. At least get yourself back to base. Yeah. Let's hope I have to find a dolphin. Oh. Uh... Suicide mission. Dun, 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 dun. How's it going? Um, Nathan, must I report this? Hey, Lucas. Hey. Um. Come here. Hey, what's the screenshot button? <laughs> oh, don't worry about it. It's fine. Is he in the base? Probably. No. no, he was at the Isaac loot. I was downstairs trading, and then I turn around, and he's just there, and that's it. No. <laughs> ah! Cole, I already have your face. I want Vincent's or Lucas's. <laughs> uh, frickin'. What if I want yours? If my my bed should still be there. Okay. Oh, you have a shield. That's not fair. <laughs> Can you guys not fight, please, for the love of he, Jesus? He's blasting towards base. Give me a sec, Lucas. Guys, he's going towards base. Um, take these. My FPS is not having fun. Oh. Just. Where is it? Drill bit. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was trying to catch you, man. Let's oh, you want a shovel up. battle, huh? Let me oh, up. wait. Shovel battle, bro? <laughs> Where the hell are you guys fighting? <laughs> Nathan, 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 look here. Ah! <laughs> I have a chain. I'm going to beat you with a whip. <laughs> Cole, look, you like my chain? Dude, you got mad drip. Ah! Come here, bitch. Eat your ice. <laughs> no. <laughs> You've trapped yourself in a one-way door, Nathan. I know this complex inside out because I built it. Oh, why did I dig in the gravel? Nathan, can you not, like, dig a hole in the side of my base? Oh, I'm not. Nathan, I can't hear ah! you. Go away, Vincent. No, I hear you right next to me. No. Uh. There it is. 
Hey, 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 we can talk about it. Please. <laughs> <laughs> ah! uh, 1800 negative. <laughs> Come here, I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm gonna shove, I'm gonna shove the shovel so far up your ass. <laughs> what the f <laughs> Just got jumped by I mean, Cole. No, not, not not negative eighteen hundred. Just flat eighteen hundred, negative three hundred. How much how much damage does those crits do, Nathan? Dude, I was at two hearts. <laughs> <laughs>